What's up guys, today we're going to be editing this really cool split screen effect. Here are the two video clips I want to use for this effect. The first thing I'm going to do on this first video clip is add a mask around the center of the video clip. So I'm going to go to my effects tab and because this has quite a detailed background, I can't just use a luma key or a green screen key. I'm going to need to use the mroto AI effect. This plugin doesn't come with Final Cut Pro, but I'll leave a link to it in the description. It really easily allows you to create masks on the video. So let's drag that onto the video clip and then just select the part of the video we want to keep. So the subject and this bottom half of the video clip. And then if we go to the tracker button here and then track this mask backwards and forwards. And then over here in the output, let's click onto mask video. So now we've removed the background. Now we can drag this video clip on top of the other video clip. And then over in the transform parameters, I'm just going to drag the Y down so we can bring this video clip further down and create that split screen effect. And the bottom video clip, I'm going to move up slightly so we have better framing. So now I'm going to stabilize the video clips. So if we select them and go to here on stabilization on both of them. And then if we select them both and right click and go into a new compound clip, now from here we can speed up or speed down the video clips. So if I add some speed ramps by holding down shift, pressing B, one there and one here, then we can speed up the beginning and the end of the video clip to add a speed ramp. So now we have the speed ramp added and because it's in a compound clip, both of the video clips are affected by the speed ramp. Now let's add some motion blur and some color grading and this effect is pretty much done. I'll leave all the links to the plugins I used in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.